Angels podcast here. I'm Clara. I'm Angeline. I'm Lottie. Today we are here with part one of our four part dollhouse series. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> They're so interesting. Now, this is just a fun project. It was so much a quirky, fun. Quirky, quirky project, a y'all. Quirky one, recreating these small children's dollhouses. Like, how fun is that? And you can go to them, and some woman wanted them for an amusement park or like a place for people to stay for the weekend that played with dolls when they were younger. I think that's cute. Me too. It's quirky. You know? I mean, I don't think I'd stay there. There's no walls on the front. You know what I mean? You know. <laughs> That's true, <laughs> but maybe they hook up little maybe. mosquito nets or something. Something. I they mean, didn't ask for that though. They just didn't even care. Did people come in and are they like? I don't know. I don't even know if there's a bed in there. Well, maybe they bring their own car. I have no idea. There might be a bed in this one. Maybe they just walk around for the day. That's true. Now she was very specific about all of her orders, and she said, "I want it to be exactly like the dollhouse I had in my childhood, complete with all the toys I had, oh, no. all the stickers I had on the dollhouse, everything." Oh, that was crazy. It certainly was. But I also want to say, maybe you know those giant chess boards that people have. Yeah, yeah. Maybe it's like that, like playing that for the day. I think oh, so that's too. True. But maybe it's a place like a wedding venue or something. Who knows? You, you know? know, or like a little amusement park or a playground for kids. Who knows? What no she's judgment. Doing with it. You know, she's not hurting anyone with her weird idea. Right? You know, just benefiting us with the money, right? You know what I mean? That's so true. Working hard to make this a reality. Yeah, you know what I mean. And I'll tell you something else. She was so generous with the money that she paid us for doing this for her. Right? I think she's an eccentric billionaire. You know what I love? I love that little raised place. It's going to be the grass. I know. Like, you know what it's going to be now. Right? No it's secret. right there. Oh, you that's know. so pretty. It's supposed to match up to that, you it's know? It's so cute looking. Oh, my goodness. And the shutters on the windows. Can you tell me something, though? What? what? Could you imagine if you inherited this house and it was the one you got to move into? Your right. old auntie has transitioned to another loft and she wants you to have this beautiful mansion right in the smack dab canal district of, is this Willow Creek? I think so. This yes. was Lottie's build, by well, the way, Well, I don't know what I would say. I mean, you'd be I'd like, like, thank you. You'd show up all excited I and mean, then you'd be like, but it's missing walls, though. You could add some walls, probably. Right? You know? I mean, if she's an eccentric millionaire. It's also yeah, neat, though. <laughs> Maybe she's, you know what? Maybe she is recording a reality show or something. Oh. It'd be easy to film it with the, you know. Maybe it's a set for a movie. Who knows? It does seem like that, doesn't it? It does. Oh, it's coming back in, that house. I know. I had to say, you have to shave off this corner here because we need these windows lined up better. You yeah. know? Oh, the my details. Goodness. Details are important. They are so important. I really like creek. how you have the wood beneath the grass. Me like too. Foundation. Yeah. That's so smart. Right. Well, look at that little wood on the on the dollhouse. It's, it's so exactly. accurate. You know, it really is too. I Did mean, you play you're looking dollhouse? at it and you're thinking, "Wow!" And then you get the sod right there, the turn, and you're like, "Okay, it's not done yet." Imagine the neighbors. I know. <laughs> Could you imagine? <laughs> well, they were standing out watching, and they when were. they found out that there weren't going to be extra walls. Oh, you turned out. You turned out. I to, turned that's out. That's a good idea. Towards the canal. Yeah, just a quick you turn. Know. A quick <laughs> turn, y'all. <laughs> Remember how we were talking about the crane? Well, once we the figured crane. that out, <laughs> once we figured out the crane, we could move the houses any which way we want. You know, exactly. and I'm like recreated this hedge over here. I had to get so many gardeners oh involved. Oh my goodness! Right. Experts uh, in the field. Right. Wow. That is a tricky situation. It really is. Hedges in the air. And to get them so straight. My goodness, yes. I mean, you trim the bottoms or whatever, but it's just such an interesting house. Look at oh, the details there. Wow. That's crazy. Oh, no. I had to go in there and be like, well, I'll stack a few of these. What are they called? Patio stones. Oh, wow. Wow. That's what I yeah. call them. Patio stones. Uh, and then get those little details down where they curve and swirl. Wow. 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 That's cute, though. That Isn't is it? the cutest. I mean, I'm fond of this. My kids were so excited watching this happen. I know. Oh, I yeah. had a dog house like this when I was little. Is this the con you had? Mm -hmm. I love that. I didn't have one of the big ones like the other kids. No. no. This is something like my daddy made and my mama detailed. Yeah, because it must be where we get it from because our fathers would look at 
you know, the catalogs of the toys that we wanted, and then they'd make the toys for us. I know, we had like little plates out of bottle caps and all that. Sock dresses for our dolls, you know. You know, like we're living in the deep country we were. You know, we don't have mean. a lot of supplies. You know, my daddy is so frugal. He has always got all kinds of strange ways to save money. I know. You know, he's not a hoarder, but in a way, he, like, saves little things that he knows he's going to make into things. It's like a recycler, but he never Yeah, yeah. It. it, like, runs in the family oh, yeah. because Alina has the same thing. So that does she, my sister, you know, know, I know. I mean, All their basements and garages are full of... I call it junk. Things other people are throwing away that they, they call say, it potential. You, you know? know? It's to crazy. Each their own. To yeah, each yeah. their own. You know what I mean? That's where I am right now. It's nice to have someone you can give things to when you're done with them, though. You know what I mean? Instead of just, here it goes. I don't know what to do with this. And then all of a sudden your sister pops up and she's like, I know exactly what I can do with that. And you know, she's getting through it like a piece at a time. She's actually making things. Elena? Yeah. yeah. What did she make true. recently? Well, recently she made the cutest little dog house that... Well, we have this old crate thing that was filled with all kinds of bric-a-brac. I gave her all of that. And bric a brac she, You know, it's oh. a cute term. Isn't it? So, what'd she make the roof from then? You're not gonna believe this, but she put a sort of epoxy on old clothing and made shingles out of it. What? She did. How do they have time for this? They're so busy. I know, right? They are working in the military. They have new babies. They patrol oh, no. as officers of the law. Officers of the law, they're patrolling Strangerville, keeping it safe because we cleared it up. Yes, we do. You know, you can check that out in our series, Strangerville. Yeah. Oh, we cleaned it all up. We were the saviors of the town, y'all. We really were. Oh, oh no. no. And we never else? talk about that enough, you know what I mean? What else are they doing? Oh, they're, um, you know, training their dog because they work in the canine unit. I know. Oh, yeah, they train other people's dogs occasionally. They have a lot of kids between them. Wow. That's crazy. Alina just got married. She finally just got married, by the way, y'all. In case y'all have been following along and hearing about Alina, she got married finally. Okay, what's his name again? King Guggen. King Guggen. I would say Dugan. I know, right? I know. It's oh. crazy. I don't know why. King Guggen. I heard a rumor that he was flirting it up with someone. No. I can't remember who. I'll have to rack my memory. Well, she's not at all jealous, so hopefully it was just like playful and funny, but if not, you know, she can always stay in my house if they get divorced, you know? I know. It's true. I mean, Tessa flirts with everyone. That's my sister, and she does. I bet it was Tessa flirting with Ken Guggen. She flirted with my ex-husband. I know, I uh, heard. I mean, it's part of the reason that he's my ex-husband. You it's know. So true. Part of the reason, but I won't go into it all. No. I just can't. No. No. I can't have that negative. Too, too painful. I just can't. No, mm -hmm. girl. You shouldn't have to. You know. It'll curse this dollhouse. This poor, beautiful dollhouse. Now, look how sparse the furniture is. It's like, oh, no. it's so funny and cute. Well, it's because that's what she had in her dollhouses when she was younger. These small pieces of furniture. She said, make it like it comes from the factory and then... I'm gonna add all the toys from my childhood room. Exactly. Just that is you so wait. Funny. Just the, you wait. The way that you did that plant was so cute. It really <laughs> was. A little transplant. I know I had to because I needed a oh. red vase, y'all. This that, is that's amazing. It's so accurate. It's giving me chills. I know. It really cute. is. Well, this is so cute. It was I mean, so hard. Some, some things. Finding wallpaper. Right. You know. Really? That does get really hard. You know what's weird about this dollhouse? Just searching and searching. What? It doesn't even have between walls. I know. No. Or it outside doesn't. walls. That's so strange. Well, it is and was the cheapest dollhouse. It was dollhouse. the cheapest dollhouse out there. It truly was. They you saved know? a lot of money on those between walls, you know? Really do. And the exterior ones, too. Oh. Oh, how cute. I was just adding a little uh, framework. What do you call that up there? I on forget. The roof, yeah. Roof I call it trimming. Oh, yeah. Trimming. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's all the toys from her room. That is she so remembered them. Funny. Every no. detail. What a project. It's 
Such so a project. Cute. Can't even imagine the cranes that had to come in there and haul those things. <laughs> <You know? laughs> Getting them custom made, quite a chore, you know. Little what I mean? Scary big baby. I mean, let's be honest. <laughs> that baby looks a little frightening and small, but it looks really, really frightening and big. Cool. So true. So so cute. Thank y'all for joining us. Thank you. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.